want to be the girl. Sorry. How come you get to be the girl? Because my hair matches better. Oh. <laughs> well, aren't we cute? Yes, we are. <laughs> <laughs> what are we doing in this? I don't outfit? know. Oh, well. I don't oh, this hi. Was, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, welcome to today's that. episode of the SPI Chamber <laughs> Today Show. <laughs> I she forgot where she was. I did. Wait, what's a good pirate name? Like for a, a man pirate. I, um, I don't... I'm Joe the Pirate. And this is my girlfriend, Josephine the Girl Pirate. Piratess. Piratess, yes. Piratess. <laughs> so I bet you all cannot guess where we are today in the pirate thing here. Uh, but you're going to see in just a minute. Uh, I'm Alita Bagley. I am the president of the South Potter Island Chamber of Commerce. My face is hurting. This is like, and this, this is, is your idea. This is my piratess in crime. <laughs> and you are. Introduce I, yourself. I am Diana Harville. I'm oh. the marketing director for the okay. chamber. Okay. And uh, we're going to get out of this uh, thing here in just a second and sit down and bring Please. some guests over that we have today to talk about some exciting things. So. Uh, Diana, you go out first. Why me? Well, I'll go out first okay. then. <laughs> <laughs> if that's what you prefer. All right, put it back. Put, put it back. Put it back. Put it back. Okay. I'm the well, one, I'm the one that's gimping. I guess I shouldn't have done that to myself. Exactly. I? That's right. <laughs> well, you go behind the camera, and I'm going to pull a chair over here for our guests. She's doing your normal kicking me off. Right? Yes. Okay. Yes. Throwing you out. Throwing me out. Okay. Well. well let me tell you where we are today. We are at Friends of Animal Rescue, and we have Sherry and Soul. M Soul, but her name is Mata Soul, right? And we call her Soul. And they have two little cuties with them that I'm going to hold, one of them at least. Let me see that boy over there. Oh, he's so cute. Look at this. He's already adopted, sorry. <laughs> yeah, oh, you are so adorable. So how are you doing, ladies? We're wonderful, how Good. are you doing? Oh, we're always having fun, and, and it's such a beautiful day today. It really is. It is, so who is this here? This is little Kiwi. Oh, Kiwi. Kiwi was found stranded, lonely, with no mama, and brought into the shelter oh. for us to take care of her and find her a new forever home. Uh -huh. She's about 10, 12 weeks old, Super sweet, just a snuggler. Yes, Diana's like, I want to hold her. <laughs> and this is little Odie. Oh, he was so also cute. found just ba abandoned here on the island oh. and brought in to us. And he gets to leave today at noon with his new forever oh. family. And he is also going yeah. into a home where he's going to have a big brother and a sister who oh. have adopted from us as well. Odie, you are so lucky. He's such a good boy. You are. I can't believe anybody would abandon you, but you oh. are going to be so happy. Nobody's going to abandon you again, are they? Never. Oh, so um, if you all have not adopted yet a kitty or a dog, you need to come in and look around. Don't go to one of those puppy mills or those you just need to adopt. That's the best way to do it, isn't it? Always adopt, don't shop. That Oh, that's a good one. Always adopt. All right. So um, I hear you guys have some events. You had an event? We had an event, Puppy Bingo, which was a great success. And the audience, it was full. There wasn't a seat left in the house. Everybody had a great time. We want to thank the Inn at South Padre for always hosting it for us. Oh, they're great. And everybody for coming out and supporting us. It was fantastic. How fun. And uh, so you do these events as a fundraiser. Correct. Mm -hmm. And what does the, what do the funds go for? The funds come back to take first and foremost to take care of all of the medical yes. care for the animals. Every animal is spayed, neutered, microchipped, vaccinated, cleared by a vet before it is adopted out or if it's a kitten or a puppy and it's too little to be done, then they're brought back for it to be done. That's a policy that we do not waver on ever. Well, that they good. need to be spayed and neutered always. Right, that's right. And uh, Marisol, what do you, Saul? I'm sorry. Either one works. Okay. Well, what do you? What's your? How long have you been here? I've been with Friends of Animal Rescue 
Sands for about seven months now. Okay. Seven fabulous months. It's yeah. the most fulfilling job I've ever had working with these animals, getting to work side by side with amazing Sherry. It's yes. been fabulous. Um, I'm the administrator assistant, mm -hmm. administrative assistant, and this is probably the biggest joy is when I get moments to play with the babies. Aren't they adorable? Yes, they really are. Oh, you shaking? Are you yes. shaking, baby? <laughs> Poor little thing. Sweet little kiwi. Yes. This is her little snuggle bug. Oh. So how bug. many uh, dogs and cats and animals do you have right now? So currently we have about eight dogs mm -hmm. and about 29, 30 cats. Okay. Oh, everybody needs a kitty. So come yes. and get yourself a sweet little kitty you can pick. And um, so tell me about this other event that you're having. Our next big event is this Saturday at Clayton's Beach Bar. Okay. It's called Tales on the Beach. Mm -hmm. Our theme this year is Ahoy Salty Dogs. It's a pirate theme. <laughs> Hence Can't the photo the up here. <laughs> <laughs> and it is from 11 to 2. Mm -hmm. It's free to the public. Bring your animals out. It's all in educating and helping you care for them. Mm -hmm. We will be having a clinic to where you can get microchipping for only $10. Okay. And rabies vaccines for only $15. Wow. And there's also canine RGV is coming to do a presentation and they'll set up an agility pin out on the sand okay. and they teach the humans how to train your dog. Oh. It's more 80% training the human, only 20% sure. <laughs> training the pet. And they will be out there doing a one-on-one -on -one with everybody. Uh -huh. We also have um, South Bark Grooming will be coming out and she'll be trimming nails and cleaning ears and wow. she does it for free. Wow. With any donation somebody wants to give and then uh -huh. she donates the funds back to us. Uh -huh. Can and I get my nails trimmed and my ears cleaned out sure for free you too? Can. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Well, that sounds like a wonderful event. I think we've got. What are you doing? She wants to snuggle I with Kiwi. Okay. Here's her little baby. I'll tell you, this woman won't behave herself. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with her? It is a pretty sweet one, isn't it? We've also invited out, there's four other shelters coming to join us to bring mm -hmm. all of the pets they have that are looking for forever homes. So we will have a pet parade. We will also be doing um, contests. There's a largest breed, smallest breed, mm -hmm. best lookalike, human to animal lookalike oh. contest. And best trick contest going on and it's a lot of fun just had by all it right. really really contest. is costume contest you don't have to dress like a pirate theme you can dress anything that <laughs> okay. you want all right. and it is from 11 to 2 mm -hmm. and please bring all your pets out there yes. with you all pets do need to be on a leash yes of course yes and it's a lot lot of fun out there it truly is well i bet that is and <laughs> Is it going to be a beautiful day? Oh, We're yes, it is. We are praying for good crossed. weather. You never know, because yeah, lately it seems like it changes every eight hours. It really does. <laughs> it really does. It does. And we also want to thank all of our sponsors who support us for this event to help educate homeowners and help get them new animals adopted into their homes, because we couldn't do it if it wasn't for our sponsors. Absolutely. Well, you do have so many wonderful sponsors, and it's because this community and our visitors know the importance of what you all do here. And it's not just, um, you know, people that live here that lose a pet. You know that, that tourists here on vacation and they bring their dog and it gets out and gets lost. And how horribly frightening that would be to have, to lose your pet on a vacation. Yeah, happens a lot, especially during fireworks season. Oh, happens of a course, lot. yes. But they have such a great, um, following from their website and their uh, Facebook page. Anytime an animal is missing, it goes out on social media to thousands of people. Yes. And so it's just your whole program that you do here is fabulous. And I know this firsthand because as some of you may know, I have lost my Jojo uh, twice. <laughs> And it was through the efforts of Friends of Animal Rescue that I was able to find JoJo. Of course, the last time she got out, I killed her when I got her back, so she's gone. No, not really. Not really. Just but, twice? Yeah, just, just twice. twice. Okay. Shh. 
<laughs> All right, maybe three times. I don't know. We have pictures of her climbing a ladder, getting on a roof oh, to hit her. Please. <laughs> I had to have knee surgery after that. I hurt myself on that ladder. <laughs> but I'll tell you what, Mike Gonzalez, because she was on his roof. I don't know what I would have done I if remember Mike hadn't that. been there. That was pretty amazing. <laughs> on the roof? Um, yes, she was up Jojo's on. Jojo's a bird. On a second. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Yes, <laughs> Jojo was a bird, which is why she gets out because they fly. And uh, but anyway, she is home safe and sound and has not flown away for a very long time. But uh, I know it's because of your all's efforts that I was able to find her because you guys got the word out right away. And um, so here we've got some posters here um, of the event on Saturday, Tales on the Beach. And um, it's going to be such a fun event. And so on, it's Kiwi. for a amazingly great cause. Now, is there an, an entry fee? There is no entry fee. This event, thanks to our sponsors, we are able to put it on for free for everybody to come out to educate on health, taking care of your pets, getting them vaccinated, giving them um, microchipping so if they ever get lost you're able to find them mm -hmm. the presentations from the trainer to help you work with them this is all for education to help pet owners and to get the animals in need of homes adopted please if you are interested at all please come out that's not only the pets we have in our shelter but the pets we have in four other local shelters in our area so we welcome you to please come on out again it's saturday from 11 to 2 at Clayton's Beach Bar and Grill. And we also want to thank Clayton for hosting this event. He has hosted it for us every yes. single year. Clayton thank you, Clayton. Very generous. Thank you very much, Clayton. Okay, well, we appreciate you all taking the time thank to you, be with Alita. us. You know, thank you, you can Diana. hear thank you the so passion much. in their voices when they talk, can't you? Because they truly are passionate about what they do. And we're so thankful to have all of them. Tony is here somewhere. Um, we saw her flitting in and out. Uh, but we are so blessed and fortunate in this community to have you all here taking care of our animals that we love and finding them lost ones homes. And thank you so much you for everything. There's Tony. That. How are you, Tony? There's Tony. Hi. <laughs> I'm sure you see Tony on Facebook all the time because she's always showing off all the cool things that she has in the store. And that's the other thing, make sure that you come in and do some shopping here. They've got beautiful furniture and clothing and just about anything you could want and all of the proceeds go to this cause. So do some shopping, have fun on Saturday. It's a very family friendly event. Bring your kids, your grandkids. Oh, that's another thing. We also have Kids Corner out there at um, Tales on the Beach. So there'll be an area where your kids can go. They can color, they can play games. Adults will be there to watch them so the parents can walk around. So there is also a kid's corner out there. How fun. Well, you all please join us on Saturday at Clayton's for Tales on the Beach at 11 a.m. And you're gonna have a great time and it's for a wonderful cause. And, and again, thank you to all the sponsors and supporters. Um, you are appreciated more than you know. We so. couldn't do it without you. Truly, we couldn't. Yes. So thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Okay. Well, you guys have fun on Saturday, and we will see you next week for another episode of SPI Chamber Today. Y'all take care. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. Bye.